Good people of YouTube, my name is Spanner, welcome back to another episode of a Necronox. Okay, we've gained access to the library, so... Oh, and um, we finally discovered the function of the bugs that are all around... Well, every planet, really. So the thing is, do I need to actively search them out? Are some varieties of bugs rare? Because the um, they seem to have uh, different colors. And I have not been... Um, well, I have not been uh, marking their uh, locations. Okay, but um, let's find Stiletto first and bring her to the library and then we'll find out um, the actual function of the bugs. There she is. Here we go again. Okay, back to the library. See what Grumpos has discovered. Oh, here are some bugs. Hey, I got a red beetle. No bugs are coming out. It feels a bit silly to me that only now that I have discovered the function of the bugs can I actually pick them up. I mean, why couldn't I just start a bug collection or something? I remember there were some, uh, I believe, purple ones down in the factory, but I don't feel like going back there. It's a bit far away. But maybe we should. Well, let's see the bug function first. Okay, this is going to take a while to explain, so both of you be patient and keep an open mind. This sounds harder than it is. All right, boys and girls, cut the cackle and pay close attention. I want everyone to look at each very closely. We are now the deadliest people in the galaxy. This latest breakthrough allows us to harness Mystech, modifying and configuring its functionality to create our own flexible designs. The key was these bugs and this special host. Weren't you wondering what this was when we were pounding on it, Slick? I ran across it a few years ago at the Brabulon junk sale. Ha! <laughs> didn't think they... They didn't even realize it was Mystech. Bought it for a steal. Anyway, I've been sitting on this slag for years, not quite knowing how it fit into the puzzle. I'd almost given up until this handsome idiot unlocked the mystery for me. You see, all pieces of Mystech are just frozen slags of Elementor Mystech, hardwired with only one function, fire slag burns, poison spin poisons, and so on and so forth. Some slags, however, serve as hosts that can be modified by the biological circuitry in these bugs, allowing you to create mistech that burns in one configuration and poisons with another. The bugs must have been bred or engineered to serve as data input for the mistech hosts. The information must be coded into their genetic structure. Let me show you how it works. 
On the bottom of this host is a single node below a roughly hexagonal ring of six other nodes. Note the seventh, the seventh one in the center. That bottommost node affects what the host does and may even harness complete control over the primary functioning of the bio device. So when you place a bug on a host, certain nodes will glow with a chemical light that indicates active nodes. If you look carefully, each is slightly colored. These glowing nodes either determine what color of bug you can place in them or how happy the bugs will be in that particular slot. We'll need to experiment to know for sure. Also, some bugs contain more involved data and light up more nodes than others. Keep an eye out for these more valuable bugs. And one last thing. I have reason to believe you can feed these bugs even when they're locked into position in the host. Look around places we found mistake for anything these bugs might be eating. I found one of them chewing on a petal from w one of those reblooming life flowers, so let's try some of those first. After that, maybe they eat Pippi. I've asked Fatima to keep track of our hosts. One of the perks of being a trailblazer is that we can name them whatever we want, since we're the first to discover them. Okay. What's your problem, Ace? What part of my lecture didn't your small hand basket of neurons understand? Just put a bug on the bottom nodes, it will dictate the function of the device. Then put other bugs on some of the glowing nodes above it to complete the function, then hope you have enough energy to use it. Don't worry about the other hoo-ha, your brain's probably doing 60 trying to tie your shoes in the morning. Okay, so are we all done here? Okay, so now that we've figured out the Elementor system, let's seek an audience with the Grand Mysterium, shall we? Aha, so this, this is the function that I needed to unlock, Elementor. We'll need more bugs for that. Ah, uh, should I really go into the factory and get a purple one? It's tempting. Well, if I... No, if we go into the factory, there was that uh, slag of mist deck in there that we need... Pro we probably need a tractor beam. So we'll probably come back here with uh, Democritus. Detective, so pleasant to see you again. Is there anything I can get you? Some cheese or wine, perhaps? How about an audience with the Grand Mysterium? Sold! Come right this way. Oh, really? It was that easy? That was easy. Wait a minute. Doesn't the Grand Mysterium live up in the tower? Mm -hmm. Then where are we going? The Mysterium Levant? Ah. Uh -huh. You're gonna make me do something, aren't you? Someone has sabotaged the main pump deep inside the Levant. If no monk has the strength or courage to brave the many miles of dangerous terrain leading to it, but we know you can be trusted with the job. I'm not your handyman. Forget it. I'm sure the Grand Mysterium will want to congratulate you personally for handling this problem you're a leech locate the main pump determine the problem fix it you make it sound easy what if we can't these doors don't open from the inside huh well we're going into the Levant anyways well, there may be some bugs here.
Got a generator, access gate. Check oxygen power. Okay, let's go right first. Here's the lower 11th exit. There is no power to this pneumatic door. Okay. We are not going right. Oh, bugs. A white beetle. Okay, and three weird creatures. Fire frogs. Oh, that's right, I can... Um, I got a new weapon for Grumpos. Let's see Stiletto. She does decent damage. They do decent damage as well. Oh, that guy da died. I didn't even realize it. Their name is uh, Lava Frogs. Okay, Grumpo's taking a bit of a beating. And he seems to be on fire. Oh, is he dead? I think it's dead. Cool. Let's see, Grumpos, Vistin, didn't I buy something new? Staff cap, blader, st oh it's this, okay, blader, st oh yeah, the, the one, yeah, the other ones had to keep. And let's see, um, let's do some equipment here. Callusum. These... They both have the same energy, this one has more shields. Circle of, of safety. It's good. And what else can I have? Protects from poison, increases miss block when level, protects against slow, more speeds. One this bracelet increases miss block. Okay, Grampos can keep side chain. Side chain is good. Boots can maybe we have Bane. Maybe Nutswalker. We have the anti winky amulet. Let's increase the miss block. I'm not sure what Winky e is, but it will protect from poison. Now you don't have anything equipped. Slow Strike is excellent on her, nice. She has some Vistin Double Blades. Shield Cell, Anti-Winky Amulet, and the Speed Shore. 
I have to give this to someone. So I'll just keep it in my inventory for now. Oh, another one of these. A petal. Oh, and we need to heal. Okay, the others, the others are still uh, still have uh, decent health. A blast sack. And what do we have here? Anything good? Annulet of Alertness. What does that do? Protects from consciousness effects. That might be a good thing to have. Go right. What the hell is that thing? I don't like that. Oh, I don't deal a lot. Well, I don't deal a lot of physical damage. Maybe Mistech will be the answer. Activate. No, I'll wait for a. Um, let's use a nut spark. I'll wait for the other ability. Slow spout. Oh, yeah, this deals more damage. As for Grampos, we'll use Yammer. Perfect. Oh, he's confused. Nice. And we'll blind. Choose a massive slow strike. Still alive, huh? Use a small side pull. And I don't want to use all my um, power right now, so... If he's still alive, I'll probably use some uh, special attacks or beat attacks or something. Damn, Stilet... Stiletto takes a while to, um, to charge her uh, special attack. See what it is. Pain pir pirouette. Ah, 400 dam. Well, I guess this guy is highly resistant to damage. Let's heal fields. Never used this one before. Oh, 
Ah, oh, cool, it's a full heal. Nice. Insufficient harmony for missed active harmony. Well, I think I have enough power. What exactly is harmony? This guy is really tough. Is this a boss or something? Or just a really tough guy? At least I've, I've got him com on complete lock... Well, almost on complete lockdown. He recovered. Mistake. Wish I had my poison spin. That would have been very, very helpful. Ah, it's finally dead. Stalak Titan. Okay, Nine thousand experience. Okay, so we defeated this for nothing. There is nothing here. Great. There's a time minder and some machinery. Well, we can't do anything here. Let's see, there was another path around here. Um, let's see, we've been there, we've been here. We have not been through here. Two more pathways. This leads to nowhere. Oh, there is a, a bag of some kind down there. And there are two more... Yeah, two more ways we can go. Let's go this way first. What is this? Gen bridge retracted. Check oxygen power. More machinery. So is this the? Oh no, there was the other door. I was wondering if this is was the entirety of the um, uh, of the Levant. But there was that door at the start. Okay, let's go down then. Bunch of lava. Can I start this one? Mysterium Levant. New worker overview. Since the new Levant worker turnover rate is somewhat high, this terminal provides information about the workings of the Levant machinery. Reading your pads. Pads indicate the workings of various machinery. Orange text means unpowered, grey means off and yellow means on. 
The color of the switch below each pad will correspond to the state of that pad. Watch their colors carefully. You can only activate a pad's function if its button is gray, unlit. Also, the control pad's function, title in the whole big scheme of things, will be blinking. So you know where you are and what is going on. The utility generator. This powers the main support systems, like the lights, these terminals and the generator bridge. This is supported by a double backup system and has never gone off. The auxiliary generator. This powers important things like the auxiliary systems, power bridge and the main access gate to the lower levant. Lavatic pump systems. These are the heart of the Mysterium Levant, the very machinery that draws the mistech laden lava out of the planet's core for sifting and processing, from the filtration systems to the mistech conveyance system down to the huge Lavatic pump itself. This is what the Levant's all about. Good luck and try to last a week. Okay, now we know kind of what's going on. Unfortunately, it's time to end the episode. So. Thank you guys for watching, hope you enjoyed some more Anachronox, and as usual, don't miss the next, the next episode, because I won't. I will see you all next time.